Today I'm gonna be showing you guys a couple of different ways that I like to use Vibrance. There's lots of different ways you can use it, which is why it's one of my favorite lines. So one of my favorite things about the Vibrance line is that it has this clear shade. So this 000 is just a straight clear. And I like to use this in a lot of different ways. So basically the first way is to kind of create like a very wearable, pastel, fun kind of fashion color. Uh, this is great for a client who is kind of wanting to dip their toes into the fashion color world, but they're a little bit afraid. Um, so mixing it with the clear, and I'm also going to mix that with the 089. So this is an additive. So this is something that will kind of like mix with the clear. It won't last for super long. So it's kind of great for like, even if they wanted it for an event, um, or if they wanted it just like for a festival, or like I said, if they're wanting to just kind of try it out, but they're a little bit afraid. So I'm going to mix this with the clear. And then I'm also going to mix it with the Vibrance Gel in six volume. So this will be just deposit only, no lifting. I mean, she doesn't need any lifting. Her hair is white already. Okay, so for this side, I really want to create just like a warm rose, a rose gold kind of vibe. Um, this is beautiful over top of a balayage. It's beautiful over top of just this kind of like fresh bleach out. So in this situation, she has no, no remaining pigment. This would be like if she was pre-toned already. So I can go straight in with the 788 and clear and I don't really need to mix in any sort of additive. But if your client was super warm, say she was like a level eight, um, I would definitely mix this with some of the 1-1 one -one and the 2-2. Two -two. Uh, the 1-1 one -one is anti-yellow and the 2-2 two -two is anti-orange. So you would, it's just always nice to have that extra bit of toning power in there so that the true color that you want to shine through can. So I'm going to go ahead and mix straight 788 with clear, and I'm going to do 10 grams of 788 with 20 grams of clear. We've got our 788 and our clear mixed up. So I'm going to go ahead and start applying. It also, Vibrance just mixes so easily. I know that, that sounds like a silly thing, but like it's so easy to mix and you never have to deal with any sort of like weird um, clumps or any sort of like inconsistencies that could show up in your color, which is always a good thing. <laughs> All right, so these guys can already see, this is already looking like a really pretty rose gold kind of almost peachy tone. I don't have to be as, as careful. I can be a little bit quicker with this application because of the way that it spreads so easily. And I'm also doing the same, I'm doing the same tone all over. So this is goes through pretty quick. You can also apply this with a bottle at the root and kind of melt it down. Josie Valet does it a lot um, and makes it look so easy. I don't know why I'm scared of using bottles, but I've definitely seen people use bottles and it works really well as well. And I love, love, love how it shows, kind of shows up right away. So you can really see like if you miss a spot, if spots are more saturated than others. Like I just love that you have that instant visibility. It's something that is not always prevalent in every color line. So I really, as a, as a creative colorist especially, a lot of times I'm formulating on the fly and I'm trying new things. So I kind of love that I can see right away um, if, I'm in, if I'm going in the right direction or if I just need to rinse it out. So again, for this, the formula is just the 788, which is a medium blonde red extra, and then the clear. And I, I mixed... 10 grams of the 788 and 20 grams of the clear. So you guys will see how this comes out after and you can adjust however you want. Like if this still feels a little bit too bright for you, you could add less of the 788 and more of the clear. Okay, so I'm gonna stop here and pull it through. So you guys can already kind of get an idea of what it's gonna look like. Just a nice, pretty rosy pink. Like, see how quickly you put, can put this on? It's so nice. It just glides through so easily and really is like such a time saver. I just saw a blob of color hit my floor, and this is not, I do not own this apartment. So, something that rocks about Vibrance is it really doesn't stain, which is really, really nice. Um, just in terms of like when you're renting a suite because you know obviously you're paying rent there and it's not your salon so it's just it's just nice that you don't have the fear of like having to wonder how you're going to get it out of the floor like if you ever are to move um but also on that note it's really nice when working on wigs um because it doesn't stain the lace which is 
always very important, uh, an important thing to avoid. Okay, so this side is our rosy peach. So it came out really pretty. And this was the fat, the formula for this side was 788. Um, we did 10 grams of 788 with 20 grams of clear. So it left us with this really pretty kind of like peachy, it's almost like a bronzy peach. Um, it's really, really nice. So that's how it came out. I just wanted you guys to be able to see, um, cause I know it looks crazy and a little scary when it's processing, like I was telling you guys, but you have to trust the process. So this is how it came out. Thank you guys for watching. That's all I have for you today. I hope you guys learned um, some cool tips and tricks about vibrance. I hope this makes you want to try it out. And thank you guys so much for watching.